Hey, this is my review of the Halo GT1 Pro. I know there are a lot of reviews in this device out there and also want to create my own and start my journey in this platform. I've seen a lot of videos regarding these earbuds and comparing it to the Xiaomi AirDots. But in this video, I'm going to show you what this earbuds is all about. First up, we will see this little pouch. It's nice. I don't know if everyone can get it, but they got mine. I have it. In the packaging, it's cool. Now we'll see the packaging of the earbuds itself. The earbuds have Bluetooth 5.0, 800mAh power battery case, 25mAh power for each earbuds, and they are claiming to have a 25 hour battery life which is long for its price. And it has also IPX5 sweat resistant so you can do some workout with it. Open this up, we are greeted by the earbuds themselves, which is the build quality is real good for its price. And speak of the price, the price of these earbuds cost $20, depending on where you at or shipping and stuff, but it's less than $20. Next in this little box, we got two packs in here. First one we have this micro USB cable and it's still micro USB but we got a free cable so it's a plus. And next in here we see these ear tips. We have this small tip and the I think this is the biggest one because they have the medium one within the earbuds themselves already. And next here we have this greeting card from Halo and last one we have this manual which we will need to connect this device since this device doesn't have any physical buttons in it. The locking mechanism in this earbuds case is really good. It's magnetic and I like it. It's strong magnet but it's a little hard to open it with one hand like the AirPods but still for its price point, for its quality you can you can't blame them. I mean, it's really good. It's built well. It's, it's nice. The earbuds themselves are small. They are lightweight. And it has this matte finish which is a big plus for me. The case has a matte finish and the earbuds themselves have a matte finish. So it feels really premium and it doesn't feel cheap at all. And I'm surprised for the build quality for this price point. Upon using it for a week, I still haven't charged it. So I mean the case, the battery life is solid, it's good. I still have a charge it since I got it. And I use it like for my entertainment consumptions since the day I got it and it's real good. The one problem I had was when I was listening on a podcast and I went upstairs had a couple of drops. Even if it claims it has Bluetooth 5.0, I don't know if it's our internet or our, my phone or the earbuds itself. But still I wanted to share with you. Sadly, this earbuds doesn't have active noise cancelling, but it blocks or it isolates some of the audio from your background, which is which is good. And overall, the sound quality is real, real nice. I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with this, especially for the price point. If you really wanted to get your head in this wireless world, and this is the future, I guess. But overall, I recommend it. I hope you guys like this video. I saw it would be great. See you guys in the next one.